Hello friends, good evening. Uh, today we'll be showing you that how exactly does a professional trader or how exactly or smartly you can fire a straddle basically without the need of a coding and saving lot of time with lot of exciting features. How you can do that in a smart way with the stock so okay so first things first now if you see these grids uh, there's there are a lot of grids okay because this bridge is whole itself is like a big vessel it has a plethora of features you have ample things to play around with like manual trading uh, automated trading algorithmic trading okay but as a specific user let's say i'm just an options trader okay so what should i do first okay just to begin with so what I'll, i will do is i'll go to settings i'll go to settings and plugins and i'll just go on the appearance so i will untick all of this okay right now i'm just unticking it and i'll just tick on options and the positions okay and i'll say save settings now if you see all my fields are filtered so now i see only the specific thing this is how you clear the cluster if you are a very specific particular feature user of stock so this is how and this video highlights how does a professional trader plays around with the straddle in the markets okay so let's let's move on to first towards a basic uh, way of firing a straddle let's say uh, this is the c or this is the p now i got to fire a shot so one time i'll go and click and say fire okay and this is how uh, it will go okay and then again i will select another strike enter the quantity whatever quantity i want but at the same time i do not enjoy the additional benefits that i actually seek from my straddle that's how professional traders work with options like how do i do it differently or rather i would say how do i do it on a very smart way so let's say we'll go to the options tab i'll add a portfolio here okay I have selected Nifty 18th August and let's say I will select the straddle the short straddle if you can see here now I get these these fields are predefined okay I can see the ATM strikes now in case I am the type where I specifically choose my strike prices like whether it's 35000 30 I mean 15000 16000 whatever I want so in the strike selection I'll choose as normal if you can see then I get the strike specific selection if I want the relative ones like atm plus 100 atm minus 100 atm plus 50 okay so this is the way we work with the between the normal and the relative this is the difference now right now since the market is not uh, live right now but i'm showing you how exactly do you do it tomorrow or maybe day after tomorrow we'll be covering this up on a live market as well so it will give you the exact feel or the rather an exact experience that how does the strategies work with the options module available within stockso okay now if you can see whether you want this atm to be calculated on the basis of spot prices or future prices you have a choice how do you want the price type to be ltp bid and ask or bid and ask average how do you want the order type to go like market or limit okay now these days there is uh, there is some kind of new system which has fallen in wherein people expect that if my one leg sl is hit okay move the another strike sl to cost so you can just tick the box okay uh, and if you wish to like apart from like we have selected short uh, short straddle now if i wish to buy let's say buy the straddle okay so all i have to do is just tick that okay and it will change if you can see here it will change automatically i can select the strike uh, strike prices i can define the lots let's say i want 10 lots okay for example i can define the target now you have three specific areas to define your target either on the premium itself either on the underlying movement okay or on the absolute premium basis like on the basis of this prices okay so you have a choice again the same thing in the stop loss as well okay you can even define the trailing target and the trailing stop loss you can even define the spread limit okay now let's say another beautiful feature comes in now this comes in very handy when you are playing around with uh, like four legs or five legs this bridge module supports up to six legs one shot firing okay so let's say on on let's say if if stop loss is hit or target is hit along with this if you want to exit another particular leg then you can just select so along with this leg even that leg would be exited so this is the advantage that you get in this uh, uh, drop down box okay if you wish to add a leg just click here and you know you can just add up the leg let's say i will just put it for your reference uh, atm plus 100 okay and i'm buying in the ce and i'm also putting in atm plus 100 and i'm buying in a pe okay 
so i'll just go and click this okay so now, now it's by uh, c and by p for example <clears throat> so i can define individual legs every particular leg can have a stop loss target trailing stop loss now to read more about these fields all these fields you know which which are present right in front of you all you have to do is this blue bar do you see click for help the moment you click it it will take you to a document to a specific options module document which will help you understand basically what these fields do okay how would be the product type mis or normal let's say mis now strategy tag as we have shown in several videos strategy tag is nothing but just a name in the grouping which is available on the strategies tab you can define quantity by exposure by uh, maximum lots okay uh, you can define the slippage you can define the maximum wait seconds now what if one leg has failed okay do you want to keep the placed legs or do you wish to exit the placed legs so now this is again a choice given to the user if you can see order slicing as asterisk marked now that's an upcoming feature now let's move on to the below field you can see the combined premium value here okay now if i say execution mode now how would be the execution happening now either it would be on start time okay like i can define run on days like monday tuesday wednesday so every morning it's going to run uh, at that particular time after i manually verify api login i've i've logged in started the trading tick the strategies that i want to work uh, their way around today in my accounts definitely that's the way to go about it okay now second type of user is they say when the combined premium right now if you can see it's negative 160 1.75 so i am saying execute a straddle when it goes to negative 170 then only you execute the straddle so it will wait for that price to come and then only it will strike now third option is the manual like you you don't need any such conditions you just want to keep your strategy ready and whenever you feel like to strike hard you can just click the box execute i mean the button and it will execute now there is fourth uh, option also available which is the underlying level now what is underlying level let's say nifty right now it's at 16529 so i am saying that when next uh, when nifty reaches 15 uh, 16535 that is when i want you to strike this okay so even in the execution front you have four choices how do you want the leg execution to be parallel or sequential okay now i'm going back again to the start time i'm just defining the start time now many a times you may see that you know there is a huge gap if you see here between the strike prices the difference is like 97 and 64 so you want a particular premium now i'm pausing it here okay because this needs to be understood now at 10 am atm c is at 200 and atm p is at 250 the premium gap is 25 percent which is higher in this case bridge will keep checking the gap until the gap comes within the mentioned range of 10 percent okay so now for example if i define here as 10 percent so it will maintain and look for the balance or the equilibrium of the prices okay and that is where the moment when it comes all of this thing is practically not possible when you're playing in hard this is how professional traders play around with the option strategies that is uh, that is why amateur traders lose in the market okay because you miss out these arenas what the professional traders enjoy but never mind because now stockso is there that can hold your back better in the markets okay so you can define the start time you can define the end time you can define the square of time now coming to the target area you also again have a choice of target as combined profit which would be nothing but let's say my strategy reaches a profit of 5000 rupees just square me off square off everything just move me out of that okay absolute combined premium just the way we uh, saw that you know that let's say i'm going in short so when my combined premium reaches uh, uh minus 140 minus 130 okay combined multi-target is an upcoming feature it is not functional yet underlying movement now uh, on the movement let's say of 100 points for example okay so if nifty has moved 100 points then you book a profit and close the strategy okay so you have a choice the same choices are available when you come to loss field as well now in between do you see this portfolio profit protection what exactly does is let's say i have defined a profit of uh, 5000 rupees but at the same time i'm telling it that if it reaches 3000 rupees lock my minimum profit at 1500 rupees okay and with every 200 rupees in profit trail my profit by 100 okay so this is how you can utilize the field so to read about this 
area as i showed you that you know either you can just take the mouse there okay and it will show you the relevant field explanation okay else the best way is that you go and click for help so that you get a very detailed document and you can read about this exactly and how it's gonna happen okay so uh, moving uh, further uh, let's say do you see the exit order type now you also have a choice here as whether it would be a market order whether it would be a limit order how your exit would be either when your stop loss is it or your target is it or when you you know you're squaring of the strategy uh, sorry not on the squaring of the strategy but uh, how exactly uh, do you want it to be fired market limit or sl now if you select sl now this is again a beautiful feature because i am defining here slippage of 5 points and wait second of 10 seconds so it's going to send an sl order with a slippage range calculation of 5 points and a wait second time of 10 seconds now either of it if it is hit okay immediately your sl order will be converted to market order and will save you from the horror of the market in case of sudden spikes which is oftenly seen so this is again a smart move that stockso has provided to its users so that you can be even more safer when you are using sl order instead of market order because many a times sl order may not get exited uh, at the exchange front as well uh, if your time is not defined or let's say you know you didn't get the price so you may be stuck so there has to be a mechanism that is why stockso is called as a intelligent trading bridge so all i'm going to do is i'm going to name the strategy as str1 or whatever name you want to keep okay so i'm just putting in the name of str1 i will add up the remarks if i wish to see my payoff chart i'll just this is how the payoff chart will open up if you can see here max profit and max loss has been defined here okay i can move the i can change the ivs if i wish to i can check for my payoff uh, movement if it the price moves this way then this could be the probable loss or you know this could be the probable loss either way okay so i will just close that okay and i will save portfolio now this strategy has been saved here if you can see here all i have to do is the morning is go and click on verify api login go to live click start trading and just enable this and sit back the best part about stockso we do not restrict you on making the number of strategies like what other platform does you know you can make ample option strategies either on nifty bank nifty or even on stocks okay and just sit back relax and enjoy now when you wish to see more details about your trade all you have to do is go and click on this plus icon if you see here so it's going to show you exact things right now this below area is uh, blank because the market is not open the trade is not live but once we cover up this video live you will understand better but this was a primary understanding that how to work around or how to fire a straddle the way a professional trader does but even on a smarter note with the stockso so i hope this video and this exciting feature would be loved by many users you can download the 12 day free trial and explore these features either run it on live accounts or you can use our best live trade simulator and experience the whole scenario of how your strategy would function during the live market or uh, with your defined conditions so don't forget to press the bell icon and subscribe to our channel thank you for watching guys